Docs Meta now allows you to save generated PDFs in your Google Drive account. Setting this up is straightforward. I'm here in an automation. Um, and at the end of that automation, there's a new option now, a new area called Actions After Document Generation. And here we have a Save PDF in Google Drive option. I toggle this on, which allows me to pick a Google Drive folder. I can pick a folder in my drive or in shared drives. Um, we're going to use this test folder here in um, uh, my drive. Um, takes a second, then we will also see that being selected here. Um, I can open this from here um, and we see that um, there are no uh, documents, no PDFs in here at the moment. If I now go ahead and run this automation from Airtable, but it really works from any data source. So the data source doesn't matter here. This is after every request being sent to Docs and Meta and a PDF being generated, it's going to be saved in the specified folder in your Google Drive account. If I run this, um, in this case, from Airtable, um, we will see in a second that we have uh, an invoice PDF appearing here. Um, and we should also see the PDF appearing in our folder. Mm, I think I had Google the Google Doc URL, yeah, Google saving the Google Doc enabled as well. So we see that appearing here as well. Uh, so the PDF is generated and saved uh, and delivered to Airtable. But at the same time, we also have a PDF in our specified drive account. As you can see, the name is the same. The name is set um, with the um, document name option here in the case of Airtable, where we select a field in our Airtable table uh, to specify the name. Um, in this case, that is a formula field. Um, if you are coming from other data sources like Glide, for instance, there it's a bit different. There you set the document name straight in Glide, but it doesn't really matter. In the end, the document name, no matter how you set it, is going to be maintained in the generated PDFs being stored in your Google Drive account as well. Yeah, hope that helps you. Hope uh, you can put that to good use and looking forward to your feedback and speak to you soon. Happy automating.